There is a ploy used by repressive regimes to indoctrinate people. It's called the big lie, a claim so outrageous that no one would believe the group was just making it up. The big lie today is that there is no difference between men and women barring childbirth. To look at how this big lie gained ground, we must challenge our assumptions and look to history. This channel released a video on the simplistic notion of progress and you're encouraged to view it in the link below. Essentially, society doesn't progress linearly with time. There's progression in some areas and regression in others. In some areas, women are advantaged. In others, men are advantaged. Radical feminists claim there is a patriarchy as men do better than women in some areas. But evidence is required for all claims. Screaming you're right based on anecdote is not evidence. Interestingly, there is evidence from a Swedish study that men are discriminated against when applying for jobs in female-dominated sectors like childcare, nursing, and preschool teaching. But women aren't discriminated against getting into male sectors. The most basic mistake Brits and other Westerners make is examining the history of gender equality for a middle-class lens. Let's make it very clear. For the vast majority of human history, the vast majority of the population, 85%, were peasants. Men and women worked from dawn till dusk on farms, ploughing, harvesting, threshing, cutting wood and caring for animals. Middle class concerns like freedom of speech, right to vote, right to not be boiled alive for treason, were very far from their minds. Instead, peasants focused on basic survival amidst famines, plagues, and wars between rival nobles. Radical feminists misunderstand the nature of the patriarchy back then. They think all men oppressed all women. Instead, a minority of male nobles and knights oppressed everyone, women and men. Only recently, with the Industrial Revolution, did the middle class grow and the type of patriarchy middle class feminists understand crop up. But even in the Victorian era, there are advantages that only women held, meaning the picture isn't as clear as it seems. For example, just after this era, the carnage of World War I made three million men from the British Empire casualties, many of them conscripts. Women were safe from this bloodletting in World War I. And the righteous suffragette struggle? As late as 1867, two thirds of men could not vote. The first wave of feminism from the 1800s to the 1960s and the early part of the second wave had a noble vision to address real, clear injustices. Let no one think that it wasn't right for married women to own property or women to get the right to vote, to receive equal pay, to not be discriminated against in jobs, or use contraceptives so that they can plan their families. In many non-Western countries, these things still need to be achieved. But after these victories, the movement went off through increasingly vague, imagined, patriarchal behaviour that has grown into hysteria. Tim Hunt, a Nobel Prize winning scientist who made a joke about women in labs and had to resign his positions after a Twitter firestorm is just one of thousands of victims of radical feminism. And for every new movement, there's a new language used to lazily tar those criticizing you, woke, manspreading, and mansplaining. In addition to job discrimination, men now face an education system which makes them lose out. 57% of undergraduates are women. There are women-only scholarships, but no men-only ones. And boys get worse grades in school, partly due to a feminised learning environment. What is to be done? First, if you're a man, stop apologising for rational beliefs. Have the strength of your convictions. If you're a woman, try to empathise with struggles men's face, so as to have a more balanced perspective.
Ultimately, the only way an out-of-control movement is stopped in an electoral democracy is if politicians stand to lose votes. So the right and true conservatives need to get angry, get organised and get politically active.